Debra Gartenstein with Quirky Gourmet. Today I'm going to show you how to make a spinach and cannellini bean dip. Now cannellini bean is like a white kidney bean, so it's about the same size as a kidney bean. Uh, but it's kind of buttery flavor to it. So I'm going to put these cannellini beans in the food processor. Now I have wilted my spinach ahead of time. When you wilt spinach, you basically cook it until it's just cooked. With spinach, there's such a fine line between just cooked and overcooked. So yeah, I just cooked it for about 30 seconds. I'm going to put that in there with the beans. I'm going to put in a little bit of garlic. I roasted the garlic ahead of time, which is nice, but you don't absolutely have to. Okay. And then I've also got some roasted onions here I'm going to put in. Going to add some olive oil. And some fresh herbs from my garden. Got some rosemary. And I'm going to pre chop that by hand. Because otherwise it'll stick to the sides of the food processor. You get big stems, you don't want that. A couple of oregano leaves. I'm going to mix this up with just a little bit of yogurt. The reason I didn't put the yogurt in the food processor is because the blade will break it down. It'll make it way too liquidy. And you want your dip to be thick enough that you can dip stuff in it. OK, a little bit of salt. And there you have a spinach and cannellini bean dip.